So yeah, anyways, let's go do this kitchen. Wait, Sink. so I'm not going to be able to eat dinner? Well, I did not say you won't go eat at all. I just said, I don't know if I'm making the beef stew tonight. You're going to eat dinner. I just wanted the record to reflect that he eats <laughs> dinner every night. <laughs> Sunlight that always stays Dinner by the waterway It's that sweet life Raise your cross Made some do crack a smile He asked if I could stay a while I'm living that high life Time to catch a flight but you can make What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel, Tiffany Tiana. If this is your first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you are a return viewer, thanks so much for your support. So, um, I waited to the last minute to try to <laughs> switch out things for fall in the house. I've been waiting because I ordered this doormat for the front door and it's taking forever to get here. So I figured I'm gonna stop waiting for that to arrive and just start switching out what I can. So I just switched out, I don't know if you guys, is it in the shot? Yeah. I just switched out the um, florals that I had, remember I had the tulips, and switched out the candle, added a little pumpkin over there. If you hear some wind, it's because we have the window over our sink open, um, just because it's an amazing fall breeze, so we just have that. I'm about to open the door in a second and close my screens. But this candle, you guys, is so cute. I had some friends over this weekend. I was supposed to pull out the camera because I was kind of doing like a charcuterie board spread. I had like a fruit one, a meat and cheese and cracker one and stuff like that. But I started running so behind that I didn't have time to like set up the camera and prep me doing it. <laughs> and then I had to like kind of get creative and I, I couldn't, I, did, I didn't get the final look I wanted, but I think it still turned out cute because one of my friends doesn't eat meat and so I can't have the meat touching anything so it's you know when you have to do that it's kind of hard to put the meat fruit cheese crackers all on one plate so i found thankfully i have a lot of boards <laughs> so i was able to split it up but um i did put an instagram reel on the finished look so if you guys are curious go to instagram tiffany tiana home you can see it there but she brought me housewarming gifts so um one of the things is this candle it's so pretty there we go isn't that so pretty? So yeah, I, I put it on there for my little fall vignette that's on the um, counter. And I removed the, it had a thing on the top that said the, said the scent. I removed it. So I can't remember what the scent's called, but it smells really good. It's a nice fall scent. She also got me, I put these up one second. We washed them and put them up. But she also got us these rocks glasses, but I get closer up in a second, but there's like a indention here where you can hold a cigar because she knows we enjoy having whiskey and cigars sometimes. So let me show you up close. It's a set of two. They're really, really big. See that? So you place your cigar right here. So I thought that was nice. Um, and then, then the last thing in the package was this bar of soap. It's the fragrance is pumpkin patch. I haven't opened it, opened it because um, you know I don't want to re reveal the soap scent soap yet. It's a fragrance soap, so I thought it was cute, and the packaging is really cute too. So that was nice of her to bring me a gift. Um, I also need to go and replace the front door reef. You know I have the spring um, door sign up now. I need to go put my fall wreath on the door. I told y'all I ordered a fall mat i have an outdoor mat that is going to stay season by season the f one when it has f on it but i layer another mat under it and that's the one i want to switch out by season so right now so as a spring one out there i ordered a fall one it's taking forever but i also ordered a matching fall pillow covers for my outdoor pillows on the outdoor patio couch that's just a tip that i've 
I share where if you want to kind of switch out seasonal decor your home and you don't want to have like too much stuff packed up in your storage or you want to save a little bit of money, get pillow covers uh, rather than like a different pillow for every season. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do that and then just wait for the doormat to get here. I wanted it all at one time to see the final look, but yeah. I also want to show you guys, I, um, remember I told you guys I was going to move the three mirrors that was in my formal living room into my office. We did that, so I'll show you how that looks. So let me take y'all with me. Okay, so here's how they look on the wall. I think it looks much better in here. Let me turn on the light. Ooh, that was bright. <laughs> I think it looks much better in here than on the other wall because one, this wall is shorter, so um, the mirrors look just better in terms of the space. Yes, I like how it turned out. And then I still am gonna find a larger mirror for out there, but just wanna show you guys that. What's up? Um, I also wanna show you guys, I got these cute cups to go on my coffee station. See these are right here, the to-go cups and the lids. They also come with these sleeves. The sleeves are just okay, but I love the look of the cups. And um, I switched out, remember I had some brown sugar right here. I switched that out and put the brown sugar back in the pantry. But I often have guests that come visit and they leave early, kind of like after their stay, they leave early the next day and get on the road. And I want to send them off with some coffee, you know, if they, you know, leaving at like 6.30 or 7, you know, something where they don't really, they're not really um, going to wake up and chill out for breakfast and stuff like that, but they're just getting on the road. I at least can offer them if they want to take some coffee or tea on the road. So I love that. Um, I think I'm going to go and stash up on some more. <laughs> um, so I got those from Home Goods, but of course, if Home Goods is out, I can go on um, Amazon. I normally have the two sweeteners right here. Y'all, tell me why Home Goods did not have my salted caramel one. So he over here lonely, don't know what, this glazed donut junk, I don't know. They always have it, and I always pick up like two or three when I go, but I was slipping, I ran out, and I don't have, I don't, I just don't understand. I just don't, you know, okay, okay, I'm stressed out. I need to, I need to find my salted caramel sweetener ASAP, okay? All right, you guys, it's a whole new day, but just got a, Several Amazon deliveries, only two of them pertain to stuff I want to tell y'all about. The other two is stuff for my son, but first is this organizer for organizing some things under the kitchen sink. This one, has, you can't see it on camera, but in here it has like two brown spots, and I don't know what they are, they don't come off. So I did a replacement through Amazon. They think they're for Amazon. Maybe I should start with that. Um, so the second one got delivered today. It's kind of like a Lazy Susan, it rotates. And then I've already measured it. It fits under the sink quite nicely. So I'm gonna ship that back to Amazon, to UPS tomorrow. But yes, happy the new one arrived and it looks good. Second thing I told you guys, I think I told you guys in the previous clip, that was in a different day. So if I didn't, sorry, but yes, I am redoing the front door for fall. I'm already behind, like I told you guys, and my rug that goes with this, that matches these, that won't be here until a week or two, which is a bummer, but I really, really wanted them to match. So I was like, I didn't want to like get another rug that I didn't like as much. And then I'll just be able to put everything out in time for fall next year. But it's still technically fall, so we're going to run with it. But it got me to thinking, I might want to go ahead and get my Christmas stuff now. My, my Christmas rug that I want to switch out and whatever Christmas. I probably won't have any pillows out there, honestly, for Christmas. I'll probably just take all the patio, all the front porch stuff off. These may be too big. I might have to get a smaller size, but they're great quality. So I might have to send these back y'all and get a smaller size. But here are, let me get closer. Y'all see that? Yeah, it's like, there we go. It's the orange and white, very quality pillow cover. Here's my other pillow that, remember when I had these out for the spring for my front porch um, couch? And this is supposed to go in here, but see, I think this is gonna be too big. Y'all see that? So yeah, unfortunately, yeah, I have to go. I have to see if they had a smaller size, and if so, I gotta order it. If not, I might, let me see how bad, let me see, let me see. 
Worst case scenario, I could probably just let it have some extra room where I can stuff some stuff in there. Fill up the extra space if they don't have a smaller size. So, let me see. I guess it's not bad. I could probably work with that. I'm gonna, see, I'm gonna still see if they have a slightly smaller size, but if not, I can work with that. So, yeah, let me look. Let me check that. Let me get my reef. And I'll let you guys see what the um, front door looks like. <sighs> I have to meet a friend soon, so this might be in the morning. It's gonna be, it's still gonna be the next clip that y'all see either way, but I don't know if I have time to like sweep the patio, um, go check on this on Amazon and go set up that stuff and take you guys along with me. I have to kind of go get dressed because I can't go out looking like this. I mean, my hair is fine, but you know, I'm looking a little, little bummy right now. So I got to go gather myself together, change my outfit and get ready for my friend who's picking me up. But yeah, I wanted to show you guys those two orders. And then also in the same video, I show you the front door for spring and I also show you how I organize the kitchen sink. That'll be in the next clip. So see y'all in the next one. After I turn the camera off, a light bulb just boom in my head. And I'm like, wait a minute. I have some extra pillows in my storage. We don't use them now because they don't go with anything in our current house, but I never threw them away just in case and I'm happy I didn't. So I have two of these blue pillows that are larger, larger than this and the same size. And then the same size for these. So instead of putting these pillowcases over my spring porch couch pillows i'm going to just put it over these since they weren't being used anyway so yes because they don't have a smaller size on amazon i did look but then i was like wait a minute i could use a different pillow it don't have to be that pillow so i'm happy about that it's gonna work out so yeah let's just want to give out an update but let's see how it looks all right, I'm gonna stuff them in, but I don't wanna rip nothing, so let me be patient. Sometimes I'll be impatient with this kind of stuff. If you hear music in the background, my son is over there playing Roblox on his iPad behind me on the couch. So, he went outside, he was riding his scooter, but now it's starting to drizzle, so he came inside. <laughs> Before it rained, it was gonna rain on your head. Do you know what movie that's from? <laughs> yeah, you don't, you never seen that. Okay. Wait, which one? It's a movie I'll show you one day. What's the name of it? I ain't gonna tell you because you're gonna look it up. I'll tell you. I'm not gonna look it up. Yeah, you are. Can I just have a number? Mm -mm. Okay, so. Perfect! Yes, ma'am. Ah! Uh, this is why I didn't throw those pillows away because I was like, ain't no need me having these pillows. They don't go with anything. But I was like, you never know. Let me just keep them in my store. Just little pillows. They're not going to take up much space. And boom, baby. So, yes. <sighs> all right, for real. I'm going to go get ready because my friend's about to pick me up. And I'll show you guys with all this stuff on the couch, whatever, in the next clip. All right, bye. Okay, going to switch this stuff out. This is the pillows I showed you guys, the pillow covers. I already inserted the pillow in there. I know I told you guys I ordered a, uh, a layering rug to go under my front door mat that coordinate with these exactly. To give you guys an idea, this is what it's gonna look like. So this is the one I have for spring. I'm gonna wash this, but that went under my front door mat as a layering. And the one that I have is basically orange and white instead of black and white. So this would be my spring one. I have orange and white for my fall. Just like that. And then I think I'm just keep with the trend and maybe do like a red and white or like a burgundy or white or something like that for Christmas. But we ain't at Christmas yet, but yes, I think I'm, I'm thinking that's what I'm gonna do. And that'll kind of be like my seasonal trio. Cause this goes out for spring and it stays through summer. So I don't really need two for that. Okay, you guys, so I got ready. Uh, my friend is on the way, but I may have a few minutes. So I'm gonna try to show you guys the pillows now outside while I wait for her to pull up. So let's go. Okay, so I'm putting them right there. I don't think I need that black one. Um, I don't really want to be too Halloween-ish. I might keep it. I might get a tan one or I might just remove it all together. Um, just going to put these right here. I need to wash these. This cushion is removable. Okay. 
Okay, so there it is. I need to wash that cushion, it's removable. And I don't really like the black with this look. I mean, it's great if you're going for a Halloween look, but I'm not. So I think I'm either gonna do a tan or white or just leave it blank in the middle. But yes, that's right there. Now let me change this wreath. Let me go get the other wreath. Here's my wreath, you guys. It's the same wreath as last year. So I just brought it in from storage. Okay, so can you guys see? Okay, oh, probably not. Let me put you up some. So there it goes. I love this wreath. Lashes wreath. I'm going to rock this wreath into it fall apart. So I got this from Home Goods last year. And again, I got the pillow clothes from Amazon. Now I just have to sweep right here. I'm going to put this my mat down right there by itself for now. But remember, right, right there. But remember, I have the same layering rug that matches those on their way. My friend just pulled up. I gotta go. Bye. What's up, you guys? It is the next day. It is still raining. It's been raining all day yesterday, all day so far today. It rained like half the day on Friday. So, Hi. yeah. You too close. Hi. Hey, what's up? What's up? What's, what's up? up? What's up? What's up? Hey. Mm. <laughs> don't trip on. Don't trip on the tripod. Oh. Um. So yeah. So his baseball game was canceled Saturday. We did swim class this morning. No. His, you ain't do swim class this morning? Afternoon. Okay, yeah, you're right. Home. Technically, it was afternoon. He's right. Uh, swim class today. We went to go pick up our groceries. You all know. Well, you might not know. We order our groceries online every week, and then we go pick them up. We don't get them delivered. So we did that. Uh, my husband and I, we went to a local kind of sports bar and grill to watch the Commanders game. That's why I got this on. And we lost. If you're a Dallas fan, don't come up in my comments talking crap, okay? You're gonna be blocked. Let me stop. Um, so yeah, so, whew, child. If you're a Commanders fan out there, you know we're struggling in these streets. We went to the home opener. That was a good game. We won. That was the only win this season so far. But you know what? We're not here on YouTube Wait, to spread. What was that game spread. that we won? The very first game when me and Eddie went and you, um, we dropped you off with your grandma. That was the one Man, game we won. Mom. Your god mom. Oh. That was the one game we won so far. Oh. That doesn't mean it's gonna be the only game this season. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> um, I've just turned on the fireplace because it's been chilly all weekend. We still have not turned on our heat. We should probably make that transition sometime soon. Um, but I came on because before I close out the video, I wanted to go ahead and uh, organize under the kitchen cabinet because I haven't done that yet. I was supposed to do it yesterday and I didn't. So yes, I'm gonna let you guys see that now. It's not much under there. It's not gonna take me very long. It's gonna take me, it's gonna be real quick because not much. And then, and then I might, I'm gonna make some beef stew this week. I'm trying to see if I'm gonna make it tonight or wait till tomorrow. Cause you know, it's like the uh, Caribbean West, West Indian beef stew. Um, so it takes some time to like, let all the flavors marry together and all that. So what are you doing? <laughs> so if I make it tonight, It'll be fine for my husband and I, but it might take too long before his bedtime because he got school tomorrow. But wait, wait, what? We'll see. If I make beef soon. So yeah, anyways, let's go do this kitchen. Wait. Sink. So I'm not gonna be able to eat dinner. Well, I did not say you won't go eat at all. I just said I don't know if I'm making the beef soup or not. You're going to eat dinner. I just want the record to reflect that he eats <laughs> dinner every night. <laughs> It's just whether or not you're gonna have beef stew tonight or wait to have beef stew tomorrow. All right, anyways, let's let's go do this this sink. Bryce, listen, I know the peach is good, but I'm trying to record a video. If you can stop smacking <laughs> on the peach, please. So, <laughs> y'all, somebody come get him. Somebody come get him. 
So here's under the sink. Um, I think y'all can see everything on here. It's not much. I'm basically gonna organize the stuff in here, uh, put this in there. It's really not gonna be much under here. So let's do that. So here's the organizer here. So let's just go ahead and get to this. Make sure I'm in, no, y'all can't see that. Okay, let me dump this in here and then I'll let you guys see. So I'm just gonna take these here for the dishwasher. Put those in there. So this we have so far on that side and on this side, my plan is to have the sponges and if I have enough room, I might put some gloves or something. We have an empty bag here, okay, why? And then we're just gonna take all of these sponges and put them on the other side. Okay, so here we have so far, I don't know if I'm gonna keep this cleaning sponge in here in the glove, but right now that's just what's over there. And so I can get another one of these or another organizer. But on this side, I just have the dishwashing liquid there. And then on this side, the sponges. Um, and then I have the glove and this kind of bottle sponge here. But I don't know, I might get another one of these to go on the other side. We shall see. I'm gonna place it right here. And you guys can see, fits perfectly. Um, so I'm probably gonna search for something on this side. I'm gonna see if I'm gonna keep this in this or if I'm gonna put this in another container. Here's the final look for right now. I love it. I like it. Um, I just thought about it when I was coming to close out. So I do have another cabinet in my kitchen where I keep some cleaning supplies. So now that I've opened up some space down there, maybe I can put all those cleaning supplies under the sink and not have them in that cabinet. We'll see, at least some of them, at least like the Clorox wipes. And then I have some, um, the quartz cleaner for the counters and stainless steel cleaner for the fridge and the sink. I think those are the main three. So I think I might take those from the, over here because I also have like some Windex and stuff like that, but that's more like for the downstairs bathroom down here. But I'm gonna take some of those cleaning supplies in one of the cabinets over here and move it under the sink and then that'll open up a space over there. So I just thought about that. So I'm definitely going to buy another organizer for the other side of the kitchen sink and use that space. I mean, why not, right? So once I figure out that, of course I'll show you guys. Thank you guys for coming along. I hope you guys enjoyed this week's vlog. And if there's anything else you want to see in the weekly uploads, let me know. If you have yet to subscribe, please do. It helps me out. And if you're not following me on Instagram, go on over there, head over to Tiffany Tiana Home and follow there. All right, you guys, I'll see y'all next week. Bye.